All right, today I'm going to be going over Abomination's gameplay. This is another episode of Coach Apathy. He said this was the greatest comeback of all time, and I really want to go over this gameplay and see what... It's a great gameplay to see what he did wrong, and then what they did start doing right. So right here, especially in the garage, his teammates are pushing mid-hill, same basics. And they're going to be charging the hill. They get a good kill. They start getting some time. Uh, teammates are doing a very well job of slaying around him. And he pushes out, gets killed. There, personally, I probably would have stayed in, just preamed the door. But it's alright, sometimes people just get a little reckless. Now here he's getting shot through the middle, so he decides to rotate around. I think it was a it was a fairly good play. He could have gone through blue or just, you know, challenged from there. But he decided to go all the way around. But the good thing about that is now there's, there, his team did a good job of rotating around. So they got spawns from the top, which that's the type of spawns you want to have, especially on the next rotation. He charges the hill, gets a nice kill. Almost gets a two-piece, but gets taken out. Here they're down by about 15 points. And they're going to be rotating to the next hill. Uh, he charges in the hill for the last kill. Uh, not a bad idea, but the thing he has to do right now is get middle in school. Uh, I don't know why they have some enemies still in the middle. So he does a good job of holding the middle with his teammates. But now he has to charge the hill. Does a good job against some kills slaying. Nice, nice help from his teammate. He gets two out. They still have a pretty good lead. There's a guy in blue apparently. He gets taken out. And... That, that was an alright play, you know, he just pushed out a little bit aggressive, uh, you know, you could be, when you, once you get that type of kills and you have that much map control, you get to play a little bit more safe and just hold your position, pre him in front of you and let them come to you. Uh, he rushed recklessly in blue, but it wasn't that bad of a play, just something I personally probably would have done once I got those kills. Kills a kid in middle, knows there's another guy in middle, good movement from him, gets the two piece. A guy, Cubby, you know, now they're just trying to get scrap time here. Uh, they're pushing through to the back. Right here is 12 seconds left. You can push it one more time, but you know, with this little time left, it's not that big of a deal. Pretty sure he's gonna die now. That's fine. The teammates are rotated to the next hill, which is a really good job of them. Uh, I like the play he's doing now. He's gonna be pushing out back alley, knowing they're gonna be coming to him. Fairly good play. He's just trying to stay alive, trying to help his teammate. He killings one up. There's still one back there. He knows it. He's trying to put some shots in him, does not take him out. Chasing him up, gets taken out. Uh, right there, you know, this teammate. Uh, it seems are still getting spawned, which is a really good thing. They just need to push it out together, get the kills down low. Now there, you got to anticipate a guy already pushed down low and just pre him that. That's usually a kill you will get. Right here, a guy's trying to push out spawns. He does a good job, gets gets him off the back, and now they're spawning out. At this point, 25 seconds left. You can either have one guy pinch around or just flood hill. If you have control of the hill like they do, right now, you could just flood it. You know, get control. I see a guy on his team going all the way around, which is a really good job of him. Applying pressure. He gets a kill. And now they're just trying to kill him in the back. He tries to do something about it as well. Get some spawns. Now, even though they're doing, he's playing pretty well and they're doing a decent job at playing the map. They're still down by about almost 30 points. He gets a nice drop shot kill. Gets a nice two-piece in the window. Aw, oh, didn't get three-piece, but he did a good job to slay. I really don't like uh, where Madagascar was going. I think he should have rotated around to the back or, like, pushed the middle to the back. Instead, he just pushed the back alley, and that's going to definitely give them... Sp oh, well, they're still somehow spawning there. I guess one of the teammates pushed the middle, and the other the enemy team isn't doing so well job of holding spawns. So right here, he's going to push in the hill, gets taken out. And, you know, his teammates are not pushing the hill too much together at the same time. You know, they're not doing such a great job working as a team. Instead, they're just going one by one, get, getting taken out, and just not working together. Here, I like the play. He knows they're going to spawn back alley. He's going to go ahead and push them. It's a really aggressive play, but it pays off in the end. Uh, connects some bullets. Team kills it by accident, but cleans them up. And he gets taken out. I don't know. His teammate, his teammate gets two-piece headshot. It's all good. Uh, you know, 40 points down. I, I don't know why he's pushing back alley. This was a bad play abomination. You you should have definitely just rotated to next hill immediately. I don't I, even if you're going for that kill on the guy on the hill, that was not a good play at all. Never never do that unless like it's a it's a spawn hill. Like the hill was uh, completely away. Oh guys guys are using kill streaks. Well that's not good. Why are you pulling blind eye out? Well kill streaks. This is gonna be even more interesting. Well, they're down by about 60 points now. Exactly 60 points. Uh, let's see the comeback he's been talking about. So now, they're down by about 70 points. These guys have kill streaks out. Oh, he pulls out the shotgun. No games being played here. Gets a kill. Gets taken out by the... By, by the... How do you know? I forgot what that's called. The bird thing. 
Gets nice shots. Gets that's all four down. Gets a nice shotgun kill. I think things got interesting very quickly. They're still down by 70 points. Uh-oh. Oh, it's a Warbird. There we go. He has a one-shot one lockers. Uh, he gets a shotgun in the hill. Very uh good strat, I would say. But I know us pro players agree to no more shotguns. He just tries to stay alive. The, word, the Warbird gets a three-piece. Wow. This, uh, this is dominating the game. Now they're still down by, what is it, 60 points? Still down by about 60, 70 points. Gets the shotgun out. Just trying to do some work with it. The enemy pulls out the shotgun as well. Wow. All right, man. It's a shotgun fest. Now we got to go in here into some middle hill. He's going to go ahead and put some shots in the guy middle. He's going to clean him up. He's going to rush the hill with a shotgun. Shotgun versus shotgun. Who's going to take him out? He takes him out. One more enemy there. Gets a nice two-piece of shotgun. Couldn't get the three-piece. The guy's shotgun's in back. Uh, you know, they're playing. They're still down about 80 points. There's a huge... Hugely so. They did a lot of wrong things. They weren't working as a team. They weren't pushing the right things. They weren't rotating correctly. Now, let's see this comeback that they're gonna about to do. And you know, even though he has a shotgun in the hill, uh, their team is just doing a really good job of slaying and pushing out. I mean, they've gotten about six kills in a row, and they just keep on going. He team killed, but they've gotten about seven kills in a row. They're just slaying, you know, doing a very good job of holding down the map and holding down the hill. Damn, he is stunned. I can't even see, man. Stuns are freaking broken. So he has a shotgun out, just him in front of him, sees a guy from blue, he's going to shotgun this guy, he's screwed, team that's three dead, one guy left, they do a very good job, They're by, um, they might even get a full 60 on this hill, the way things look, they're just holding the front hill, holding the middle hill, this guy has a shotgun, he's, he's not going to be stopped in the hill, so at this point, wow, they're down by I believe 80, 80 points, 80, 90 points going to uh, in this hill, they managed to get, I think, a full of 60, maybe 55, something like that. Gets the nice <laughs> shotgun kill. Gets the last second. Um, at this point, they're only down by, what is it, 29, 27 now. And they're going to flood the hill since they're not getting spawns. I, I like the play. There's no point of going all the way around. He shotguns his own teammate, unfortunately. But, oh, oh the shotgun failed him. He could not clean up the kill. Gets meleeed. That was a pretty huge kill on for him, but... You know, things happen sometimes. So right now he's going to be pushing the hill. They cowed up. They're only down by 30 points. Uh, his team does a very good job of just executing, getting all the kills, and pushing out the back. That's something you want to do a lot. Wow. My voice cracked. But wow. That shotgun. Wow. That range. God, that gun's broken. No wonder we agreed to band it to know you shotguns. And uh, all right, only down by 25 right now. No, 35. It's about to be 30 points. They're doing a good job of holding down this hill. Communication on point, just holding it down, saying his teammates to rotate. He's just he's peeking middle, doing a good job, staying alive. Only down by ten, going to the next hill. I'm assuming they have full rotation. Oh, he gets a nice jump window shot, pushing out the front, being very aggressive. Pulls out the shotty, no problem, cleans him up. At this point, he has a shotty in the front. I mean, he gets a three piece with it. You know, I'm I'm seeing where the comeback is coming from. You know, this is just complete, just complete destroying. Uh, the other team, like, the other team can't do anything at this point. They're just screwed. You know, what more can they do? Oh, he couldn't clean up that last kill. But now they have an 11-point lead. They're doing a very good job of just holding down the hill. Uh, this team dies, but they're going to still be getting spawns, which is a really good thing. He's trying to stay alive. Got the shotgun out. Getting, oh, gets one. Gets two. Wow, shotgun just showing why it's very deadly. Damn, make it his bitch. That's what I like to hear. So, 211, 212, 213, 214. They're about to have a 17 point lead going to the next hill. Maybe make it 18. And, you know, with the shotgun, I mean, it all started like they did a they did a better job of holding the hill. But to be honest, man, the shotgun did a lot of work for, for them to come back. You know, this shotgun is very, very, very broken. And, you know, the kill streaks, like, wow. You know, I know they're they're allowed. They're technically allowed. We just pro players agree not to use it because it's very. Uh, we feel like it's not as competitive, at least in this game. The streaks aren't that worth, and you know, it's it's just not worth it. You know, it's not it's not skillful. But I mean, they did a really good job. His teammate really picked it up. This guy's got like a four piece, I think. And his teammate did a really good job of of slaying and playing together and actually executing clutch kills instead of losing all their gunfights and stuff like that. 
but I think the shotgun did have a part in it, and that's why, like, not saying anything bad, but that's why we are banning the shotgun and why we don't play with it anymore. So I think that was a great comeback. Um, overall, he, he played great. You know, the shotgun was destroying them, but they did a good job of coming back. They were down by, like, 90 points at one point. So, yeah. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. This has been your boy Apathy, and I'm out. Alright, what's up YouTube? This is a league match against AR. Unfortunately, we lost, but in this first map, we played AR on Hardpoint Retreat, and I played very well. Not only did I have the most kills or the most captures by insanely large amount, I mean, I was one defend away being with the most, which is a one point difference, which is really that big of a difference. But you know, I played the map really well, and I had 23 assists and most assists on my team. I played like a team player, I went in the hill every time, and I just played for the win. Communication was on point, and I just really want to share this video with you guys and see exactly what I did right. And